on don't forget to comment like subscribe and well today we're gonna be opening this set of 80 ohuhu markers i ordered this set from amazon uh they were i believe 48 dollars and with this shipping and tax and all that i ended up paying like around 55 dollars or so so yeah around 50 dollars for this set of 80 i'm pretty excited i know it's not the biggest one the biggest one i believe is uh i know they have one for 100 mark over 100 markers and then they have the 120 um but i decided on the 80 i thought this was good it was a really good starter set so um let's get started and let's open Okay, so once you open it, you take off the plastic. It came in a box. Uh, take off that, and it is this fabric little case thing, little baggy. So it has a zipper, it has a handle, and then once you open it, it does have like this poster board like material. I guess it's like to hold the shape on top, uh, like on the top and also around it. But that's basically just to hold the shape. But oh my gosh, these are so beautiful. Uh, these are the chisel points. I did want the chisel point because I know a lot of people prefer the brush markers and they're supposed to be the best out there. But it's like to me, it's a thing of preference and I prefer the chisel tip. And here, well, it comes just with like a little paper with all the information, the different colors it has, the different markers that are available. So yeah. So here are the brushes that this has. Uh, it says here that it's eight colors and one colorless blender. And I am gonna be doing my own swatches, like my own little uh, color chart because uh, I this is a printed page and obviously it's not gonna match the exact colors. So just to have it and to be able to go back whenever I need a color, I'm just gonna go ahead and do my own. But yeah, these are so pretty. And like I said, I did order the chisel tip so I have one side is the broad chisel tip and the other side is the fine chis fine tip. So yeah, it's a double-sided marker and yeah, I'm super excited. Oh my gosh. And these are alcohol-based markers. So they're supposed to be really good for um, blending and all that good stuff. So let's try them out. I'm so excited. Okay, so as you can see, this jumps is like 58, 59 and then 63 and then it has like 71 74 and then jumps to like 96 so none of the colors really or the numbers really are in order so i'm gonna be doing my own chart like i said and um to see what colors and i'm just gonna go ahead and write the numbers exact as they are on here because i believe they for what i see they are like in like colors uh color groups so yeah, I went ahead and separated all of them in the order that they were there. That way I don't have to be looking through each one once I start doing my color swatches. So yeah, oh my gosh, they're so pretty. So you have all the greens, the blues, the violets, purples. It's just so pretty. So now that they're all in order, I am ready to start doing the color swatches. Oh my goodness, these are so pretty. They go on super smoothly. It does have like, like a lot of ink comes out, but not like, like in a bad way. <laughs> I mean, it's just perfect. I love these. So I'm just doing like the uh, chisel tip side and then the thin side. Uh, I'm having a little trouble because I did my numbers like very tight together. So let's continue and let's see how this works. But oh my gosh, I'm loving the colors. Of course, once I got to 63, I noticed that this was becoming a problem because I had to move the numbers and then I had to move the 63 to the side <laughs> yeah so then I just decided to just keep doing the uh, the chisel tip side on these and then I'm still writing in the bottom you can't see but you'll see in a minute uh, in a few seconds the fine I wanted to try them out still on all of them so I just did it on the separate paper I mean the colors gonna be the same as the same ink so I really just wanted to make sure that none of them were dry or anything 
so yeah as you can see i'm just doing it on the side and on the bottom that you can see i actually did it on the paper on the bottom These colors are so pretty. It does have a lot of variety. It, they have like the groups of blues, the greens, the yellows, the violets, the purples. Like they're so, so pretty. I am in love with these things. And um, so yeah, like I said, I did try the fine line for the last colors. I tried the fine line on the side just to make sure that it worked. And yeah, none of my markers were dry. So I got a good set because I know I've seen some people that get like one or two that are like, uh, the ink is falling out and or dripping and then some that are like not in great condition but uh mine were all good so yeah i'm super happy with these here's the ohuhu blender so yeah like these are alcohol markers like i said and uh, they're supposed to be really good for blending so yeah i'm so happy to have my ohuhu set Okay, so then I took advantage that I had them all already out and I went ahead and put them in groups and I just put a rubber band just to make it easier to find the colors for now. I don't know if I'm going to keep them in this bag or maybe change them out. But yeah, I just put them in sets. That way, if I'm looking for a color in particular, let's say I'm looking for 49, um, I see that it's the yellow, I grab my yellows and then it'll be easier to spot the 49 rather than to look through the whole set of markers, which are 80 in this case quite a lot to be looking through the whole thing it'll be a little complicated and uh, it does transfer like the back is completely marked and then the other page in the back was complete marked so to use it I am gonna have to use like a double paper or plastic or something in the back just to protect the, the pages on the back wherever I'm working but other than that like I'm super happy with these Ohuhu markers now I'm gonna do some blending or practice some blending because I'm pretty sure you're gonna notice that I'm no expert at all like at all <laughs> but I mean I'm just happy to have these and I'm here to learn I know you a lot of you are here to learn as well so yeah maybe this video is not gonna help you learn anything about blending <laughs> but I mean I'm trying and I'm very excited to learn a little bit more but yeah, I love how the purple looks and then I did the green and yes, it did. Um, they do blend really well, so I was super happy. The red, I think I got reds that are very similar, so you can't really tell, but in person, they you can see the, the difference in the blending. But yeah, they do blend very nicely. And of course, I need to keep practicing. But yes, you all, I'm super, super happy with my 80 set of Ohuhu. These compare to Copics or Copics, and uh, but for like a cheaper, cheaper price range. Like I said, these were $50 compared to like Copics that would have been like 100 and some or $200 or even 300 depending on the amount uh, set that you get. But yeah, thanks for watching. And if you like this video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. I'll see you next time. Bye.